Hello, I'm Patricia McNeely. How are you today? I'm here from Chicago, Illinois. I've been doing a lot of traveling lately, necessary traveling, and I hope you're doing well. So in today's video, I wanna to talk to you about the Lionsgate portal. The Lionsgate portal this year is going, I just keep feeling this word, it's going to be a doozy. Now that might, you know, not be everyone's way of putting it. What does that mean for some people? Woo, 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 woo. Up, down, bumpy ride energy. However, it is part of the ascension, the overall ascension that people really get where they need to be. Now I'm gonna give you an analogy and you may feel some of this energy between now and when it really opens up. So it's actually officially still a few weeks away. But we have um, sort of layers of energy here and the energy is sort of retrograde-ish up here, moving. And it's very reminiscent of the ocean where the ocean has different currents that move things at different speed and depending on the depth, maybe really slow speed. So you may feel an energy that is called void of course, that void doesn't mean that you're a void. It, it means that, you know, things aren't null and void. In some way, your karma is null and void, but you are simply needing to stay put. You can tell this too, because it's, it seems very much like, kind of like Mercury retrograde energy, except it's not Mercury retrograde. So what do you do? The power can go out. Your device can struggle, you know, like it kind of turns on, it turns off, it's not working right, your phone doesn't work right. All the small devices get affected with these large energies. They run on a low voltage, okay? It's not something creepy about it or dark or spooky. Okay, don't make everything so spooky, <laughs> please. Please don't, okay? We have to focus on love, so... You could have that going on. But what is that really like? That's a little bit like when you're a little kid and you fall asleep somewhere because your parents took you somewhere and or you fell asleep in the car and the vehicle got you somewhere and yet your parents pick you up and they put you in bed and you wake up in your bed and you have kind of no recollection of it, but yet you feel safe. You're like, how did I get here? I'm in my own bed. I'm safe. I'm home. Yeah. That's what some of this energy is going to do because it's going to cause a reversal of fortune for a lot of people in a good way. Now, the next thing you need to know is this is fit together time. Okay. Fit together. What does that mean? That means that You'd better get ready to really work on your twin flame ascension and really learn about the etheric body. The etheric body is your golden key. That is how you unlock things. That is how you actually do what people call receiving the golden keys. Now, I know how to get people open. I help them divest the past, not really linger in the past, not have it hanging around or dragging around with you. Another thing to know about this Lionsgate energy, okay, so we have a full moon coming up here. We have a lot of the energy starting up. For some people, it is way starting in advance, and there's like pre-prep energy. That's what I call it, pre-prep energy. It's a pre-preparation on a larger scale to prepare for what needs to happen at the physical level. You're going to see some things clearly. Now, when I say that, a lot of people's minds automatically go to the government and go, ooh, get front row seats and popcorn because heads are going to roll. No, it's already happening. You've had three major world leaders like somehow losing or stepping away. You have a loss there. What you have is a leadership loss too. So remember that with this goes what is stepping into place. How are people self-regulating? How are they policing themselves? How are they catching things? How are they keeping things from being way too chaotic? 
and bringing some order to the chaos that ensues during those times. Okay, now maybe that's not your neighborhood. but This is happening in a lot of places. It is time to be aware. It is a time to focus personally. There is a lot of emphasis on children. So you're going to see health issues. You're going to see health issues you may have had as a child, such as allergies, asthma. You're going to see eye issues. Okay, and when I say issues, I'm mainly talking about ascension symptoms that need to be addressed. If there was something major medical, please address it. Although I am intuitive, I always encourage people, work with your medical team, whoever that is, your doctor, your practitioner, okay? Reversal of fortune in health means that you're on the upswing for some secondary or tertiary healing, and it can be uncomfortable. I help you with that through the reconnection of your twin flame body, the etheric body, the main one, so that you have activations and your healings and tissue rebuilding can happen. You're going to see things come up regarding money, okay? The reckoning is already happening from the pandemic times where people were very lenient with each other and now the belt tightening and the squeezing and the inflation, that's going to happen. I have very good suggestions for you for budgeting sensibly using your higher self guidance to do so because your budget can and actually should change from time to time. It's very hard to stay on a rigid budget and it's very hard to be um, you know, like stingy and have your big heart and be overly generous and overextend. There is a middle ground as with everything. Moderation is the key. The other thing with this energy is it's about the body. So if you have children, they probably will be having ascension symptoms. Time to get on board with that. Ascension, ascending parents have ascending children. I'm here to help with this. This is not just a weather report on what the energies are going to do. This is a report on what the energies are going to nudge on you and what you need to start focusing on. Okay, what you need to focus on for the month or the season, you could call it your energy balancing that's needed for the month. And what I have is a class on what to do and how to do it, how to make it expedient, because there's going to be more that happens for many people. This is very new and I welcome you. I'm here to help and I'm here to help with this to take the mystery out of it, to take the conspiracy theory crap out of it, to make it understandable and with humor and a lot of spirit. So I have a 20 day intensive class where we're going to meet pretty much daily and work through the body and draw in some live question and answer. And really, you know, support you, support some lengthy support. Do not think for a minute that it's bad to like look at comments, but honestly, you're not going to get the real support you need. You're not going to get etheric body support. You're not going to get answers. You're not going to get the response of a true Blu-ray who actually knows the ascension cycles and knows the two energies of being a twin flame creating the third energy. Your etheric body is all important. Your etheric body holds the keys. Your etheric body is going to make itself known to you and it's you. Okay. So it's not just some abstract part of you. If you're not sure what it is, please check out my website. I have a lot of information on my website at twinflamereconnection.com. Join the class. It's a really good bang for your buck, which means that everyone who's taken it in previous years, they really felt not only supported, but toted along. That is what my higher self energy assists with is getting you activated so that it's just like that. It's like you got in your vehicle and you arrive safely at your destination in your own space, essentially in your own body. So, Check it out. The links are below. You could start with my first five books. I have five books that 
help you with all of the foundational things that you need. They're listed in the description below. I hope to see you there. Have a good day. Bye.